The Opioid Education and Awareness Task Force was joined by former NBA player and author of the book Basketball Junkie, Chris Heron, today at Greenfield Community College to speak to youth in the area about the problem of addiction. Kids appreciate someone who's honest and can get down to their level. Um, we all start. I think, I think we've done a huge disservice to our children teaching addiction. I think we talk about the last day and, and the devastation of addiction. We don't talk about day one. And we all don't end up on the street. We don't, and we didn't begin on the street. Um, so I think if we can get our kids familiar with the first day out in the woods, in the basements, then we can start making some headway in prevention. You know, I think it's important for us to, to rally around this like it's a healthcare crisis. I think, um, you know, addicts need to be treated. Um, and I believe, you know, students need to, uh, we need to change the way we teach our kids. Um, I think we need to begin at a younger age. I think we need to implement this, this, um, this discussion in different classrooms. And, uh, and keep the message out there in front of them. Marisa Hebel, coordinator of the Opiate Abuse Task Force of Franklin County, had this to say about why events like this are an effective way to combat addiction. You know, there's so much pent up interest in this issue in this area that it's something like this that really brings people out and brings people talking about it. And one of the things we need to do is use this issue as sort of a springboard to keep the conversation going. It's really important that we have so much momentum going for this issue in Franklin County. We need to keep it moving and Chris is helping us do that. If you want more information or need to reach the Opioid Task Force, just email opioidtaskforce at gmail.com.